What's up, you guys? This is Mary with High Priestess Intuition. Um, this is the Distant 96. I decided to do Distant 96 for all signs today. So this is Distant 96 for Cap Son of Capricorn <clears throat> for 831 through 93 of 2022. Don't forget the basics. Time is fluid. Energy is fluid. If it doesn't apply, it apply. Everyone has free will. Only take the messages that resonate with the rest. Love and appreciate each and every one of you guys. If you like to donate, type your sister up by the links in the description box below. PayPal only, no cash app, no Venmo. It's a very private, confidential way to donate if you choose to donate. I uh, love you guys. The Just in 96 for newbies just joining is basically an energy pool of the energy of energetic space for four days. 96 hours is four days. Um, of course, as always, this is free general collective reading, so you only take the messages that resonate and leave the rest. This is for the sign of Capricorn. This can resonate if you have perhaps any aspects of your charts. Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, North, No, Moon, Hammer, Jupiter charts. I encourage everybody to check out their um, other placements as well. Your Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, North, No, Moon, Haven, and Jupiter chart placements as well for additional message or messages if they apply for you, okay? So this is for the sign of cats. Um, I did receive one channel message as I was meditating on your distant 96 energy Capricorn. I heard R and R. So R and R is basically rest and relaxation. For anybody who doesn't know, I'm sure you do, but um, I think one of you guys is taking R and R, or you're about to take R and R, or you're going to take PTO, or um, or do a vacation or a stay staycation or something like that, or just pop your feet up and relax a little bit. How that resonates and applies. I feel that's what you're going to be doing during this 96 hour period, possibly. <clears throat> or, yeah, that's exactly what I feel. Or you're about to. How that resonates. Or somebody you're connected to, because energies can be reversed. But I did hear R&R. &R, so R&R &R is basically rest and relaxation. The devil reversed. Queen of Wands reversed. Nine of Wands reversed. Confirmation from my kitty, by the way. Hey, come on, you guys. Come here. Come on. A Capricorn is getting out of a very toxic karmic cycle. Third party, third party situation. For some a sneaky link. For some a divorce. A Capricorn is getting out of a very toxic karmic cycle. I heard for some of you guys a sneaky link, for some a situation ship, um, sneaky link situation ship, for some a third party. Um, so they put you in the third party, I feel, and for some a divorce. So all those are toxic karmic cycles as far as relationships are concerned. I don't care if it's a sneaky link, i.e. situation ship, um, a third party, them putting you in the third party, or um, um a divorce. Um, if it's not healthy for you, it's not healthy for you. I don't care what it, if it's legally binding or not, and that's just the truth. Um, but it sounds like one of you, um, one of you guys, at least one of you guys, is in the process of getting yourself out, or you're about, or maybe that's what you're going to do in the 96 hours. You plug it in, how it resonates. And I think all this toxicity with these relationship crap is about uh, about what makes some of you guys take some R and R, whether it's um, like taking like PTO or something of that nature. If you work in a workplace dynamic or you just, um, are just going to take some R&R &R, relax. However, that resonates from all this drama shit. Cause this is a, a lot of drama somebody was in and I'm just being for real. You're getting yourself out of toxicity. Um, the queen of wands energy, whether it's a masculine that takes on heavy femme or femme that you were in the third party, Stinky link situation ship with um, or the um, divorce with, uh, I'm sorry, the marriage with. They have no desire, drive, and motivation towards you, Caps. None. I mean, they're showing up as no desire, no drive, no motivation towards you. Queen of Wands reversed. It could be a fire sign you were in this with or somebody else. Somebody has taken on fire sign reverse energy. Um, you're not, um, you just have no desire here. You just, it's all in the cards. You're just ready to get out of the toxicity. No desire. No, this person has no desire, no job motivation towards you. I feel you don't have desire, job motivation towards this situation either. You don't want to stand up for it. You're ready to get out. It's all clear as day in here. For some, you could be dealing with another Capricorn because we have Cap's energy, or that could just be your energy. You plug it in, how it resonates. But dear God Almighty, this is some shit, Caps. 
<clears throat> Taurus energy, Piscean energy. Leo energy. Taurus, Piscean, and Leo energy is what I just heard. Taurus, Piscean, and Leo energy. So they can have Taurus, Pisces, or Leo in their Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, or Sun, Moon, Haven, or Jupiter chart. So if that resonates and applies for you, uh, Caps. Uh, Taurus, Pisces, and Leo is what I just heard. So I feel for some of you guys, you could have been in this um, <clears throat> legally binding marriage or the third party situation snitch ship or sneaky link with a Taurus, a Pisces, or a Leo. They could have Taurus, Pisces, or Leo in their Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, or Thumb, and Hammer, Jupiter charts. If that resonates, it applies for you, uh, Caps. And Libra. And Libra. Okay. Taurus, Pisces, Leo, Libra. Uh, it can be masculine, masculine or feminine. Taurus, Pisces, Leo, or Libra. They could have Taurus, Pisces, Leo, or Libra in their Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, or Thumb, and Hammer, Jupiter charts. They could be masculine or feminine. Um. You plug it in how it resonates. Let me see if I hear anything else. I think you're about to heal from this. Take some R&R, &R, some you time, and focus on yourself. At least I hope that's what you're going to do. About to pay it forward soon. About to pay it forward soon is what I just heard. About to pay it forward soon. So that could be you about to pay it forward or somebody you're connected to about to pay it forward. But since it's in your reading, Capricorn, I think you're about to pay it forward. But you plug it in how it resonates, Capricorn. You're about to pay it forward in some shape, form, or fashion, I feel. Or somebody's going to pay it forward to you. Because um, energy's going to be reversed. But some kind of pay it forward energy, whether you're about to pay it forward or somebody's about to pay it forward to you or what have you, what have you. Some kind of pay it forward energy. All right. Well, I love you guys. I hope this helped and namaste.